Hello everyone, how are you all doing? Check for the volume, Wanda, check for the volume. Okay, is it fine? Hi! Well, <laughs> welcome in like I'm live. What? I am alive, but not okay. live live. <laughs> for the purposes of recording. Hello everyone, welcome in uh, to this pre-recorded video. How are you all doing today? How are things going, folks? How are things going? Happy Tuesday! Happy Tuesday, the week is going right along, folks. Tomorrow will be Wednesday, hump day, and my spin day. Yes, spin day, because I'll be out there picking up a few things, going to the thrift store, picking up a few grocery items, just things that I run out of, of course, for these little weekly $40 cash stuffing <laughs> grocery grocery hauls but nonetheless hello and welcome and thanks for being here i do appreciate it don't forget to like comment share and subscribe like comment share and subscribe if you already have it to my channel wanda budgets and beyond where i do uh budgeting stuff not an actual budget i do do an actual budget but not you know the recording of one etc but cash stuffing sinking funds savings challenges that type of thing, financial tips, information, all that type of stuff interdispersed in there. And a little chat along the way also into, but yeah, a lot of financial information outside of the cash stuffings, et cetera, is what I do here. And the and beyond part means it could be <laughs> any and everything. <sighs> but nonetheless, thanks for being here. I do appreciate it. Of course, I do walking and talking as I am doing now. I gotta get the steps in working on that health. Health is wealth. Even if you have all the money in the world, if your health is crappy, uh, it doesn't mean anything or it might not mean that much, etc. But yeah, getting these steps in, folks, getting these steps in. But thanks so much for being with me. I do appreciate it. Thanks so much for being here with me. So what do we have? Uh, Mr. Carl Weathers sadly has passed away. He passed away on the 1st of February. I do read my notes here I have. He passed away on the 1st of February. And if you all recall, some people have a certain age group. He <coughs> was the original Apollo Creed uh, of the Rocky, of the Rocky movie movies that you have seen. I think uh, my notes tell me that well, the internet has told me that he played in the original Rocky, which I saw, and he played in Rocky IV also in two. So yes, Mr. Carl Weather sadly has passed away. Said he was from New Orleans, born in New Orleans. He played one year in the NFL with the Oakland Raiders under coach John Madden this was back in 1970. And then he went on. He always wanted to be an actor per what this internet is saying. He always wanted to be an actor and he got to do that. He got to do that. He were in, he was in other movies. Uh, they have him right here. The Predator, which was with Arnold Schwarzenegger. The Mandalorian. More recent, Happy Gilmore. And uh, and I mentioned he was in Rocky and Rocky IV. And he may have, I think he was in other um, films, movies, also went to maybe some black exploitation stuff is what the internet said. But yes, Mr. Carl Weather sadly has passed away the first one of February this year. But yeah, I enjoyed him. I thought he was so handsome and talented also into, yes, one of the greats. He's up there with uh, Mr. Morgan Freeman and uh, Mr. Denzel Washington. Denzel and I may be the same age, 29. But nonetheless, Mr. Carl Weathers has passed away. But uh, rest in peace, Mr. Weathers. Yes. I tell you that 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 never ceases, of course. Uh, with the, the death part, of course, I'd be born, and then the death part, etc. Yeah, a lot of the great actors, musicians, singers, etc., and just folks in general, I guess, are passing away, <laughs> and sadly for people of a certain age, as people that you have known, grown up with, or you've seen them in, on TV, or just in your own life, you know, maybe relatives, et cetera. But yeah. But that is the circle of life. You, you, you were born, you live for a while, and then you 
Thank you, Anita. You got it. Thank you. Yeah. What else is going on, folks? What else is going on? Pick up the mood. Want to pick up the mood? <laughs> We're two, day, we're two days into the new week, just came off of the weekend, and I am sure that you all uh, stayed on budget, did your best to stay on budget. Got to be watching those coins all the time, and I guess even though the price of gas is going down, and of course I know that it fluctuates, but for the most part, and I think a lot of places it's going in a downward trend, that's just one area. We got all the other stuff where <laughs> something else is going up, and it's taking away the savings that you had in the gas, so... Please do your best to stay on budget and be mindful of where you are spending your money. If you don't have to spend, don't spend. If you can save first, then buy later. One of the tips that I talked about maybe in another walking and talking, I do believe, uh, the six things I think it was that you can do that are good financial things to do. Save first, then buy. And of course, you know, these the cash into envelope method would help you with that. So yeah, all those type of things. Live below your means. I am sure that you all have heard of this before. Live below your means. And just wait. It can wait. It can wait. It can wait. <laughs> just and believe it can wait. Also, as always, be mindful. I want you all to be mindful of your safety when you are out and about. Nowadays, I live here in Maryland and and it's happening in other places too. The carjackings that they are reporting that is happening in the District of Columbia, Washington, D.C. is just horrific. So yeah, just always be mindful of your surroundings. <clears throat> yeah, just be, <laughs> just be mindful of your surroundings. Super Bowl Sunday. Super Bowl is on Sunday, folks, and I'm sure that the ladies have... Uh, Bought all the stuff so they can hide their husbands in the basement in their man cave. Get out of here! <laughs> but yes, the Super Bowl is Sunday. The Super Bowl is Sunday, and of course, I like watching the. Well, I like watching the Super Bowl itself because I like football. The commercials, I am interested in seeing the commercials, and most of the time they are out a little bit before the actual Super Bowl happens. Hopefully, that happens and I get to see it before and then after and then sometimes they may have some pre-super bowl ones just as a teaser and then have the actual one for the super bowl on uh, super bowl night all that good stuff but yeah make sure you get all your fixings all the stuff you want your drinks chips all that good stuff any type of food you go to cooking chicken wings pizza etc get all of that done i don't know how it works i'm sure that people are ordering food in but i'm sure that uh, you're going to be waiting for a bit on Super Bowl night, so it may be a good thing just to make your own, etc., or order in advance and freeze if that is what you want to do. What else I got on here? And of course, San Fran the San Francisco 49ers and the Kansas City Chiefs are playing on Sunday. They are playing on Sunday for the Super Bowl. Who do you have in it? Who do you have? I hope San Francisco wins. I'm just <laughs> my team isn't in it, as you all know, the Steelers. That's my team. They are not in it this year. And uh, onward and upward next year. Steeler, Steeler Nation. Yes, sir. Prince Charles has gotten a diagnosis of prostate cancer. So, yeah, he's going to be doing treatments. And from what they report on here on the news, Google News said, is that uh, Prince William is going to be filling in on some of the duties while he is getting treatment. So, yeah. And it did say that Prince Harry went to visit him also in June. But that was as an aside. But yeah. What else is going on out there, folks? What else is going on? How is life treating you? How's the job? How are things with you and your family? Hopefully all is going well. We are into the second month. How are your goals looking? You're still working on them, still working towards them. Maybe put them on the back burner for a moment. This is just a reminder. Just a reminder. Make sure you take it out, look at it, etc. And you know, try to get back on track with it because you wrote it down and it was important to you at the time that you wrote it down. And it is possible, like I mentioned before, that you know it was it was something important to me at the time I wrote it down. Now it is no longer important. You can remove it off there, two, three, four, etc. 
can just uh, go on to the next one that is on the list. These type of things happen because life is happening all the time and uh, such is life. Such is life. What else is going on? Yes, we have Tuesday tomorrow. Like I said, it's Wednesday, my spin day, so I'm going to be out there. Got to go to the post office and pick up um, an Amazon purchase that I got. I needed some printed ink, so I haven't been able to <laughs> print out any coupons. <sighs> but uh, yeah, I'll be going to the post office tomorrow in my outing. <sighs> so, yeah, that. So, yeah, that is all I have. <sighs> I think I may just go silent and finish this thing out. <laughs> no, I'm going to turn it off and then I'll just finish uh, 30 more minutes because otherwise I'll just be silent and I'm not sure whether that was uh, useful for an extra 20 minutes, 19 minutes or so, just being silent. So thank you all for joining. Once again, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. I do appreciate your joining me. I do appreciate your clicking on the video, leaving a comment, and liking the video, all of that good stuff. I do appreciate it, folks. Take care and have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.